Jessica then Tova. It's the new Kiwi phrase that everybody seems to know about. If you haven't heard that phrase, you may have been living under a rock. But did you know where the phrase came from? Well, let's find out. So an interesting thing happened as we listened to the one o'clock press conferences as we went into lockdown, went out of lockdown, went into lockdown, uh, and the various stages of our response to COVID-19. And uh, as I sat in the lounge uh, one particular afternoon just listening to the press conference and then the questions afterwards, I thought to myself, this is interesting. It always seems to be Jessica, then Tova, or Tova, then Jessica. And so I went to the uh, footage of the previous media conferences and I found a very interesting trend. So I got my team to work and uh, we put together a little compilation video that we just thought we'd have a bit of fun with and put out there and it took off. Uh, let's watch that video clip. We are now happy to take questions. Prime Minister Anthony, what is this? Just like we have every other time if we do it together. We're now happy to take your questions. Tova. And together, that's exactly what we are going to do. Happy to take questions. Tova. Thank you. How close are we to determining And I encourage you to share that information with others. We are now happy to take your questions. Prime Jessica. Minister. Prime Minister, are you satisfied? Now happy to take your questions. Jessica. Prime Minister, what buffer is it giving you? Happy to take questions. Jessica and then Tova. Prime Minister, have we peaked? Please do remain absolutely cautious. Um, yeah, Jessica. Be patient and be kind. We'll now happily take questions. Jessica, then Toba. Where are we at with our vaccination? Please do look after yourselves. We'll now take questions. What, what, Jessica, then Toba. What's the difference? For now, though, we're happy to take questions. Can Jessica. More details about the truck drive? But for now, we'll open up. Jessica. There are 24 new cases. And we collectively keep going. Happy to take questions. Oh, Jessica. If you are we're now open to questions. Yeah, Benedict, and then I'll come to Tobin. Now happy to take questions and feel free to direct them to Professor Hendy as well. Jessica and then Tobin. So there we are, that's uh, probably something you may not have known, but you were the first to actually uh, see that video, be aware of it, because it came from uh, McBlog, uh, and it, it went viral. Uh, in fact, uh, we had over almost 70,000 views on our Facebook and on our YouTube channel, but the Herald also embedded it on their website uh, separate, so there could have been hundreds of thousands of views. Here we are, that's the Jessica then Tova Prime Minister Jacinda Ardern's Curious 1pm News conference habit. Uh, and so we thought that, well, just by highlighting that it was an issue that, uh, well, perhaps the Prime Minister would go to other people as part of her response. She would go to other reporters first uh, because of the fact that it had been made clear that it tended to be Jessica and Tova and they seemed to be the favourites. So it became a bit of a humorous thing to watch and people tended to watch the media conferences more for who she was going to pick first than uh, what she was actually saying in the, in the meat of the conference. But the amazing thing was that there was one week or one press conference where there was a variation and then it went back to the norm. And listen to the response of some of the other media. So this was our sequel video. We are now happy to take questions. Prime Minister Anthony, what is this? Tova. Jessica. Prime Minister, are you satisfied? Jessica. Prime Minister, what buffer? Jessica and then Toba. Prime Minister, have we Yeah, Jessica. Any Jessica then Toba. Where are we at? With Jessica then Toba. What's the difference? Jessica. 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 If you are Yeah, Benedict and then I'll come to Toba. Jessica and then Toba. Prime Minister. <laughs> to take your questions. I'll mix things up a bit because I'm prone to habit. I'm going to jump in the front. Henry, and then I'll come to Jenna. Happy to take questions. Tova. Yeah, happy to open up for questions. So Jessica and then Tova, I believe, is the routine. Happy to take your questions. Yeah, Tova. 
can be found on the Unite Against COVID website. Fifth. Until then though, we are now happy to take questions. Yeah, Tova. We need everyone to play their part. Yeah, Tova, Jessica. So, sorry, Tova. But if you have any questions on the we will start with Tova then Jessica. We're now both happy to take questions. Yeah, I'll come Tova then Jessica. And I know we can do it. You know, happy to take questions. Yeah, Tova. Kia ora, Minister Hinare. We'll open up for questions. I'll start with Gina. The way that the Prime Minister and her ministers have been running those press conferences have changed quite a lot over the the year and a half since COVID. It started off with being sort of a free-for-all, whoever could shout the loudest and get their attention. But now, as you'll hear, it's your, it's your Jessica's and your Toba's, and then you kind of move around. It's gotten quite political, actually. Here we are, it's all got a little bit political and uh, the, the video certainly went viral. In fact, it also seemed to filter down to the press corps themselves, the parliamentary based um, reporters. Uh, and in fact, uh, Barry Soper, who's a News Talk ZB political reporter, has been for, I don't know, 40 years or something. I think he was around in the days of Muldoon even. Uh, this was the present that he got from Jacinda Ardern, his Christmas present, and it says, then Barry, because uh, Barry Soper had got a little bit grumpy about the fact that he wasn't um, first cab off the rank in terms of questions and was kicking up a bit of a stink. Uh, and then there was also uh, Bill, and, uh, Bill and Ben. What's their name? John Owen Ben. There we go. I just about forgot their names. John Owen Ben. And they decided to get on board and they did a little Christmas trick on Jacinda Ardern. And have a, have a watch of this little clip. Required, uh, an abundance of questions at you over the last 12 months. And right now, we're <laughs> going to give you a chance to fire some questions back at them because on the phone we have Jessica, <laughs> then Tova. Or Tova, then Jessica. Or Tova, then Jessica. Who would you like to go to first? <laughs> no, you don't. We do. We do. Are you kidding? Yeah, Jessica, much more Kai, Tova. Oh, you know the voice. There we go. So it, it's it's becoming much mainstream, isn't it? Jessica, then Tova. In fact, this is the present that Jono and Ben actually gave the Prime Minister. Jessica, then Tova shirt. The amazing thing was that I actually had a look on Google uh, for Jessica then Tova, and there is a whole merchandise brand of Jessica then Tova. Now look, I don't want to skite, but I just want you to know that it came from McBlog, and you heard it first. And so as this is our last McBlog for the year, I want to wish you a Merry Christmas and just tell you that we're going to have a bit of fun next year as well. We'll cover some serious topics, but we'll also have a bit of fun looking for quirky types of things like this. Uh, and we hope that you can be part of that. And so have a great Christmas, Happy New Year, and join back McBlog uh, on a daily to two daily basis, depending on how active and energetic I am. And we hope you can be part of it. Merry Christmas, everyone. Yeah.